Earlier this week, a thick layer of Suru and Altucumus clouds left the South Africans in awe. We were taking photos of the breathtaking skies, especially during a sunset, and it's usually a sign of cooler weather to come. And it was definitely cooler on a Thursday in KwaZulu Natal, and especially the Ophelt, where it's been hot the past few days. And we're also expecting a drop in temperature on Wednesday in Halting. So let's look at your forecast. On Wednesday, the ridging high pushing in more a cloud along the eastern escarpment. It's much cooler in the low felt with light rain expected in parts of Limpopo. Fog at first over the south as well as in parts of Kuzili Natal. Otherwise, a mainly dry Wednesday. We're expecting the dry conditions to persist into Thursday and Friday. Only drizzle possible over the coastal areas. And then closer to the weekend, this cold front expected to reach South Africa. But unfortunately, quickly slipping south and weakening only to bring light rain on Saturday and Sunday for the southwestern coast. It's a mainly dry Wednesday across South Africa with a drizzle along the eastern escarpment and light rain expected in the low felt of Limpopo. A few degrees warmer in the Western Cape on Wednesday with a lovely 23 in Langabon, a southerly to southeasterly wind picking up with a 19 expected in Cape Town, 6 at first in Worcester and Robertson, a cold 2 degrees in Lanesburg temperatures in the mid-20s over the central parts of the Western Cape as well as in the Karoo on Wednesday afternoon. Foggy at first over the southern areas, late eating up to 25 degrees in Somerset East. A few foggy patches expected in parts of the Eastern Cape, otherwise a mainly sunny and mild to warm afternoon with a moderate to fresh northeasterly wind blowing between Port St. John's as well as East London. Northeasterly winds also expected in KwaZulu Natal. It's cloudy at first with foggy patches over the northern areas, later mainly sunny and mild with a high of 24 degrees in Peter Marisburg. A few foggy patches over the high felt of Mpumalanga on Wednesday morning. Cloudy at first in the low felt, but then warming up the afternoon to a high of 29 degrees in Skakuza. It's yet again cooler in the low felt of Nampumalanga cloudy at first with light rain along the eastern escarpment. Also a few degrees cooler in the bush felt, but a northeasterly wind picking up where runaway fires are at risk. It's a mainly sunny and dry Wednesday for northwest heating up the afternoon, therefore runaway fires at risk. In the northern Cape, we're expecting a southerly wind to pick up along the southern coastline. It's a dry over the interior, cold at first over the southern areas, heating up to a high of 31 degrees in Uppington and after a cold morning in Kimberley, can expect a high of 28. Also a warm to very warm afternoon for the free state. Northerly winds also blowing the afternoon where runaway fires are at risk. A high of 24 degrees in Johannesburg, a few degrees cooler in Pretoria but still a comfortable 26 expected the afternoon with northerly winds blowing the afternoon. Into Thursday we're expecting mainly sunny skies and warmer conditions over central and eastern South Africa. Mostly cloudy along the coast with only light rain possible over the coastal areas including the garden route on Friday. Friday, a southerly wind blowing along the west coast, only 20 in Cape Town, but becoming hot over the central and eastern parts of the country, heating up to a high of 30 degrees in Pretoria as well as Polokwane. Well, that's all from me, and remember, no matter the weather, win this together.